monthly brief forecast report for month of February 2023. And this is a brief forecast report for monthly month of February is a conclusion. In this conclusion, I have defined six parts with dates and each part is playing a very unique role in this month. So kindly watch this conclusion till the end. Because I'm covering one month, 28 days, 672 hours. So I put the microscope on that one. So kindly watch this conclusion report from the start till end. That's the only way you can understand what is happening in the whole month of February for you. In every form, in every way. So watch this whole video of conclusion with patience, please. Aries, month of February conclusion 2023, month of February conclusion for 2023 for Aries. First thing first, result of Mars in second house. Mars represents your courage, your confidence, as well as your aggression. Mars transiting in your second house, Aries, you may be developing some sort of an eye issue. And there may be, if you are lending people money, there may be loss of money as well. And this particular phase of time, you have to watch your word of speech. Word of speech with everybody, with family, with friends, with colleagues, as well as with your higher authorities. You might create a lot of enemies with your word of speech without realizing that. Take a review of your language and attitude and mannerism. Don't present such a way that people become cheesed off with your attitude or mannerism. This phase, Mars position in second house, you face few disappointments during this phase of time. Sometimes expected gain will not be there. Expected success will not be there. People will not, people will let down you very badly. There might be a few issues with the family members, nearest family members. Health of the partner may de deteriorate regarding the lower abdomen or back or joint problem. You will face few losses in business. Expected gain will not be there. And though you would like to incline toward a lot of religious activities or deeds. Some unscrupulous activities cannot, deeds will not be ruled out. There would be some sort of an issue will be there, but re re refrain from any living argument or conflict with anybody. Don't lose temper. More you lose temper, more you ruin your financial gain. Choice is yours. More you become out of control in your behavior, more you ruin something very important. Don't do that, please. Result of Mercury. In ninth house, Mercury's impact will be there. Mars' impact will be there for whole month. But the Mercury impact will be there with you in ninth house till 6th of February. Mercury position in ninth house is not, I'm not saying it is very positive, but it's okay. Mercury in ninth house, a new project will be there. You will be able to fulfill your desire, enjoying good fortune. And journey will be proved to be profitable to you. You'll have a success in your undertaking. You'll have some sort of rising in your professional status. Mercury position in 6th house. And now Mercury moving from the 6th house. From Mercury position in 9th house since till 6th of February. Not 6th house. Mercury position in 6th in 9th house till 6th of February. From 7th of February till 27th of February. Sun, Mercury are combining together in 10th house. The Buddha, Aditya Yoga in 10th house. The house of profession which is very very great. So during this phase of time, Aries, Sun, Mercury are there together, may I say from 7th of February till 27th of February 2023. So you will gain wealth. There will be rise in status, prestige and honor in your professional life. There might be a promotion or rise in status, prestige and honor regarding your business, profession, career. There will be general progression. Authorities will be appreciating you. Authorities will appreciate you, recognize you thoroughly. Say yes to you, whatever you want to say them to. There will be comfort in respect to of vehicle and family. Sun, Mercury, Buddha, Aditya, Yoga in house of profession. You will dominate over your opponent. The decision taken by you would be very wise. Result in success and rising in status, prestige and honor. Most of your desire would be fulfilled. Sun, Buddha, Aditya, Yoga in 10th house. During this phase of time, you would be happy. 
successful in all your efforts professionally a very good period could be expected as well you would be able to finish off the work given to you successfully on time happiness at home is also indicated due to this phase of time you could also expecting to meet someone very special very interesting due to this phase of time result of saturn and venus in 11th house starting already started since 22nd of june 2023 carrying on till 25th of february 2023 saturn and venus are together in 11th house which is a very productive positive positive union for aries during this phase of time you will be able to dominate over your opponents health will be good and you got to look after your family health there is a professional rising excessive earning change of residence is possible there will be earning from business earning from uh, gain from business as well the gain will be there from your art and craft performance and journey will be gainful your status will be rising you will enjoy associating with a lot of professional people people who have knowledge ability and skill, skill set saturn and venus are together in our 11th house if you are leading a project if you are a program manager project manager if you are a company ceo this particular phase of time signifies financial security real relief from debts you may also expecting a solution to a lot of other economic problems this period also bring you success in your undertaking your popularity would be rising your reputation will be enhanced upward move during this phase of time this is a phenomenal time result of saturn and sun in 11th house saturn and sun are getting together also in 11th house because venus will not be there forever venus will leave the 11th house but saturn will take over and saturn is joining uh, sun and saturn are joining together from 13th of february till 15th of march sun and saturn together in 11th house due to this sun and saturn together both are sword enemies but in 11th house they oh, they will be okay together this particular union sun and saturn together this means that there will be financial gain improved economic and social status this is a suitable time for you to approach your boss employer for any favor such as asking for rise or promotion you'll see a rise in position at workplace but getting an unexpected benefit from superior or higher authorities you could also expecting a profit in trade and business and wealth during this phase of time even gain from your friends your social prestige would be rising you'd gain more honor in your neighborhood health will be remain fine during this phase of time your sound health could be happy occasion for the family if you are leading project if you are a project manager or program manager or company ceo the whole team will support you thick and thin and achieve you you will achieve able to achieve your ultimate success now jupiter and venus are getting together from 15 december venus joining the jupiter in 12th house and jupiter leaving the 11th house with from saturn it left that union saturn and venus together but joining now jupiter and venus are together in 12th house there is a excessive expenditure jupiter and venus together in 11th house again jupiter and venus are very civilized planet uh, benefic planet but both are not friends and because jupiter is head of devta devtaus clan and regarding the spiritual guru and venus head of uh, uh, demons uh, is a demons guru asuro ke guru but this particular period with the, the both are together both are scholars both are supreme spiritualist both are do getting together but the animosity is not that way that which is a normal animosity but they together perform wonders but look after your family relationship and sometime you will be fearful about whatever you've done in the past journey will be proving not very productive on one hand you'll achieve financial gain on the other hand you'll spend a lot of money and this particular phase of time be aware of financial losses a huge expenditure or unexpected expenditure this period indicate unnecessary expenditure or wastage of money be careful this period also see you indulging in good attire which you may lose may say some of you attire this this phase of time you have to be aware of any kind of cheating deception theft in this particular phase of time when venus transiting your 12th house be careful prominent date if you are signing any important contract 
if you're organizing any important event or meeting, if you're setting any kind of a, uh, making appointment for a for test exam interview or romantic date, if you're going for a court date, so pick any of these dates, which will be very fruitful and productive. 3rd, 9th, 10th, 11th, 12th, 13th, 18th, 19th, 20th, 21st, 24th, 25th of February of this month will be a very prominent date and pick any of these dates, you will be successful. And wish you all the very best of luck and you'll achieve the best. Taurus, the conclusion of the month for month of February 2023. Taurus, first thing first, result of Mars in Lagna. Mars is transiting in your Lagna. Mars represents energy, courage, confidence and aggression. Taurus Mars transit in your Lagna, you may have fear from a lot of things like thieves and thugs and opponents and enemies. There may be loss of money if you're not very careful. Because Mars become make you very proactive, very highly active. And you will overactive sometimes, super active. And sometimes control is not there. Mars transiting your Lagna, Taurus, during this phase of time, there may be some sort of an issue regarding headaches, blood pressure, something to do with abdomen. Taurus, you'll pass through some sort of a period of mental anguish, too much annoyances, too much frustration, too much temper. Sometimes you can overreact to the very minute situation which you will be. Because energy is very, very high. Taurus, you may have a tendency to get excited very easily on small things. Screaming, shouting and acting and reacting or threatening. Look after your partner's health. You may be prone to some sort of an accident or injury or surgical operation. You'll acquire some kind of a money. There would be gain in your business. You'll meet a lot of people, good people as well. Taurus, your superior will be helpful. They're getting out of their way to help you out. This phase of time, be aware of any issue regarding eye infection. Be careful. Result of Mercury and in 8th house. Mercury is first 6 days in 8th house. Mercury position in 8th house is not good. Not good. Not good. Mercury in 8th house is not good. So if I think if you kindly go to the premium Try to get a premium horoscope and take the Upai for Mercury in six, in in eighth house. You should do if you can. Get the premium horoscope, monthly horoscope, if you can. Or go for the diamond subscription for the getting the to root out the Mercury position in six in eighth house. Mercury eighth position, eighth house position, not good. The Mercury transit in eight, in eighth house is starting from sixth is still first six days, first February till sixth of February. Opponent will trouble you. Opponent will challenge you. There might be loss of money. There may be hidden loss which you don't want to share with anybody. People can cheat you. People can trap you. People can trap you into situation. You can be a target of a lot of cheating and deception and fraud. Beware. Be careful. There might be issue regarding infection or some kind of a uh, some sort of a uh, issue with your tummy or chest or breathing or skin. Be careful. Going to define about result of Sun and Mercury in 9th house. So Sun and Mercury getting together from 7th of February till 27th of February. Mercury will leave the 8th house, going to the 9th house, joining uh, Sun and Sun at that time. So Sun and Mercury together in 9th house is starting from 7th of February. Only they will, they will remain together for 7-8 days and after that Sun will move to, to the next house to join the Saturn. But from 7th of February till 15th February, Sun and Mercury together, the Buddha Aditya Yoga will be there. But Mercury will remain in the house of luck for till 27th of February. So this phase, you will be involved with a lot of virtuous deeds. Any journey you take and do this phase of time will be beneficial to you. You Family elders will help you. There will be general comfort from family. You receive favor from superiors, elders. There will be some kind of disappointment as well. 
some kind of issue you expect an expectation achievement sometime won't match you have to look after your position in workplace make sure you don't have to regret any of your action done at this time watch out for any probably hurdles before venturing into something new mentally you feel hassled overburdened unstable due to several reasons result of venus and saturn in 10th house now venus will leave um venus and saturn are together they already together uh, since 22nd of january they'll remain together till 15th of february saturn and venus together in house of profession success will come to you with a hard work and efforts no doubt about it but saturn and venus together in 10th house which is a great honor and may i say that there will be uh, harmony and happiness accomplishment there will be acquisition of property or car or wealth or professional or material comfort financial gain as well you'll dominate over your opponents journey will be vain gainful your dignity will be professional rising will be there your dignity will be rising you may have to be extra careful with finances and try to avoid any kind of loans you like you to be under debt due to this phase of time be aware of enemies avoid unnecessary useless discussions totally and it might if you please if you don't avoid do useless discussion then you are leading to a conflict without any reason with your enemies so wherever the disc- useless discussion start put the, put the stop there stop don't do don't elaborate any more please result of sun and saturn sun will join the saturn uh, venus will leave saturn but sun will join the saturn in house of professional 10th house 13th february till uh, 15th of march so this is a favorable period is donate gain promotion progression success in all you undertaking sun and saturn together both have father and son both have no friendship but here they'll work together you may expect a promotion at workplace favor from your seniors honor from the higher authorities even more opportunity could be expected as well this period also donates success in your undertaking favor culmination of any stuck up deals socially you may expect even more respectable position your social circle will be getting wider meaning more positive gainful interaction particularly with companion honor from your circle of friends you may even expect to be honored by highest of authorities result of jupiter venus in 11th house now the venus is going to join the jupiter in a, in 11th house starting from 15th of february till 12th of march venus and jupiter position in 11th house is most prominent honors awards <laughs> will be bestowed upon you if you have any opponent you will be able to dominate over them friends family will provide you comforts most of your desire will be fulfilled venus and jupiter together in 11th house wealth and comfort will be acquired professionally you're enjoying rising you'll be inclined to perform a lot of good deeds this particular phase of time mostly signifies security relief from debts you may also expect a solution to your lot of economic problems financial problem will be resolved during this phase of time this period also bringing you success in your undertaking your popularity would be rising your reputation will be enhancing upward move through this phase of time you like you to concentrate on acquisition of material comfort means for players and lifestyle lifestyle improvement luxury expensive item valuable item you could expect a rise in status rise in prestige rise in honor in society cooperation of your friends prominent dates for any important like if you want to sign important contract organizing any important event meeting romantic date business contract dealings test exam you name it so pick any of these days dates for you the dates are 4th 5th 11th 12th 13th 14th 15th 20th 21st 22nd 26th 27th and 28th of february pick any of these dates wish you all the very best of luck Gemini conclusion of the month, the month of February 2023. The conclusion of the month. First thing first, <laughs> I'm talking about Mercury position in seventh house of Gemini, and is starting from the start of the month till sixth of February. Mercury position seventh house is 
not bad is very good but there might be an issue with the communication gap between you and the other people around you mam family member outside people everybody so seventh house position of mercury till 6th of february not forever and ever not for the whole month journey will prove to be comfortable to you jamana you will enjoy comfort from your partner generally you will be finding things to be favorable there may be rise in status prestige and honor business transaction will prove to be beneficial to you you can look at the favor from companions and generally result will be good there will be there may be opposition from superiors you may develop some sort of issue regarding mouth infection cough problem asthmatic illness some disappointment may also be there be aware of any kind of communication gap between you and other people around you be careful mind could would be fickle sometime making right decision sometimes you going round 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 in circle not making a right decision at right time at right moment of time that can be an issue sometimes you keep on changing your views or stand i'll do this today i'll do this tomorrow i'll do this today i'll do this. keep on changing your statement it won't work result of sun and mercury in 8th house starting from 7th of february till 27th of february mercury joins sun in 8th house till 7th of starting from 7th of february till 27th of february for next 20 days sun and mercury together in 8th house jamana you will face lot of opposition sun and mercury we call buddha aditya yoga actually this is a raj yoga raj yoga in 8th house <laughs> buddha aditya yoga in 8th house you will face jamana lot of opposition from near to dear one mercury is your lord jamana so your lord is and son together in house in eighth house so there would be strife at home there may be kind of a issue some kind of a illness or suffering this particular time period sun and mercury together in eighth house this signifies wealth and success this is a buddha aditya yoga for 7 days 7 8 days buddha aditya yoga in eighth house it indicates success in all your work and project During this phase of time, you may expecting a financial stability gain in financial venture. Surely, you would see a rise in status. People would respect you more. Your popularity would be rising. This particular period also let you acquire comfortable lifestyle. Result of Saturn and Venus in ninth house. Now the Venus and Saturn together in ninth house. They already together since twenty second of January two thousand twenty three. They'll carry on till fifteenth of February. Venus and Saturn together in house of luck. Journey all the journeys will be beneficial to you. There will be rise in professional status, gain of wealth. You'll be inclined to perform a lot of good deeds. Your undertaking will meet success. Comfort will come from spouse. this particular period mostly signify the one set of a new wardrobe moreover it also donate bodily and material comfort happiness and harmony financial gain in precious jewelry is also indicated through this phase of time business man or business people will find this period to be very smooth with satisfactory profit success in education is also indicated during this phase of time health will be remaining good in shape at home your siblings will be more cooperative more affectionate than ever result of sun and saturn in ninth house result of sun and saturn in ninth house is starting from 13th of february till 15th of march sun and saturn together is starting from 13th of february till 15th of march this phase of time avoid any tricky situation Sun and Saturn in ninth house. Financially, this period could be taxing on you. You may also find it difficult to recover pending dues from other people. People, anybody who owes the money and doesn't want to pay you, be careful. Be extra careful to avoid unnecessary expenses. Misunderstanding, disagreement may occur between you and your teacher, between you and your your leader, between you and the people, head of the member of the family, between you and your seniors. your efforts will be rewarded you'll have a keep up your efforts to the maximum result of jupiter and venus in 10th house venus venus and jupiter 10th house 
result are there and venus and jupiter together in 10th house house of profession is starting from 15th of february 2023 will carry on till 12th of march 2023 venus and jupiter together in 10th house if you have any opponents you will be able to dominate over them with jupiter venus together income will be rising events will be auspicious favor will come from government you may getting some sort of professional arising physically you will be a lot more comfortable than before there would be rising in status prestige and honor you will be recognized and appreciated by higher authorities and of your chosen field by the government or by decision maker you will be thoroughly appreciated and recognized you will have to put up extra hard work to meet success in all you undertake which you will do result of mars for whole month from the 1st of february till 28th of february in 12th house Mars position twelfth house is not good. Money can be lost through stock and share market. Money can be lost if you already lend somebody some money. People will dump your money. You may suffer a few disappointments. Your health may suffer. You may have a trouble with your eyesight. You may have an injury due to fire or weapons. Illness may plague you this phase phase of time, and the government or those people who have power over you. can be source of your trouble people can offer you people will find you give you punishment or penalty or try to trap you into some kind of a situation be careful prominent dates for any important contract signing any important contract organizing any important event or meeting or romantic date or business date or test date or examination date or signing any important contract or dealings are date these dates are prominent date pick any of these dates any whichever the date you want to choose 2nd 2nd of february 7th 8th 14th 15th 16th 17th 22nd 23rd 24th 25th of february pick any of these days wish you all the very best of luck cancerian month of february concludes in cancerian for all of you the conclusion of the month for cancerian Month of February. Uh, first thing first, result of Mercury in sixth house. Start of uh, the whole month from the not whole month. Mercury will be in the sixth house, but the start of the month may I say from first of February till sixth of February, Mercury transit in the sixth house. The Mercury transit in sixth house it can be positive and negative. It can be both. But one thing is there: you you have your enemies will be rising. Number of enemies will be rising, and this time period be aware of any kind of unnecessary anguish mental anguish or ill health your expenditure will be on a lot of wasteful things which, which are not good so watch your enemies watch your health and watch your expenditure but from 7th of february till 27th of february mercury joins sun in 7th house in 7th house for next 20 20 days sun and mercury together in 7th house cancer in due to this you may have some kind of a issue regarding a health issue regarding tummy or eye problem and there may be pain in your feet and lower abdomen or male or female health issues cancerian you may face some kind of a loss of money there will be fear uh, fear from enemies and there may be some some kind of a suffering to yourself or to your partner if you are a married guy This phase also bringing some trying time for both of you mentally and physically. This period period indicate illness. You may have to experience pain and weakness mentally. You might become restless, very much anguish, rise in mental perplexity and misunderstanding with family member due to communication gap that can happen. Result of Saturn and Venus, which is already there. Since twenty second of January two thousand twenty three, will carry on there till fifteenth of February. Result of Saturn Venus in eighth house, house eighth house, Saturn Venus no good. You have to look after your health. Money can be lost if you're not careful. Status can be lost if you're not careful. There may be possibility some kind of false allegation, but may I say I would sort of strongly recommend. move the saturn and venus together with hard task you can get a premium horoscope you will be in premium horoscope all the task are there here you need to apply task for saturn and venus together 
and there's a possibility some kind of false allegation imposed upon you education will be obstructed if you're doing any project that will be obstructed you may suffer a lot of anguish there may be some kind of illness or eye infection physical suffering danger from a lot of things if you lose your bachelor you find a companion but be aware of a dodgy companion and let's try the best but my advice saturn and venus together in 8th house not good try to uh, uh, move these two planets with the help of hard task which you can get it from the premium horoscope so get a premium horoscope if you can monthly horoscope and apply the task now i'm talking about saturn and sun together in 8th house now venus will leave the 8th house joining the um, jupiter in 9th house and but sun will join the saturn in 8th house from 13th of february 2023 we carry on in sun and saturn together in 8th house till 15th of march sun and saturn position in 8th house is not very good and be extra careful to avoid unnecessary expenses avoid making important decision choices about anything about money about people about legality about status about prestige about family personal emotional decision financial decision professional decision support from your community family members even the partner may seem absent to you there could be chain you work you do possibility forcing you let to go out of your current position there could be a lot of traveling which may be turn out stressful consciously to avoid getting involved in any kind of a living conflict with your enemies or with anyone else it is totally totally fruitless be careful don't do anything which you can't justify please result of jupiter and venus in 9th house starting from 15th of february till 12th of march 2023 venus and jupiter together in house of luck most very very important and that union for in ninth house you'll undertaking this period may i say you'll go for religious journey pilgrimages and a lot of business journey will be profitable journeys there are a lot of opportunities to associate with junior studious one events are most auspicious this phase may i say that uh, jupiter and venus in house of luck together events will be auspicious you gain in wealth and wisdom there will be rise in wealth and rise in wisdom both both w are they are coming for you there will be acquisition of land or property during this phase of time venus will when venus transit in ninth house this mostly signify lifestyle luxuries comfort valuable items one set of a new wardrobe it also donate material comfort happiness harmony happiness financial gain indulgence in precious jewelry is also indicated business man will find this period very smooth one with satisfactory profit success in education is also indicated during this phase of time health will remain good shape result of mars in 11th house mars position 11th house is most prominent can't admire enough mars position 11th house is most fantastic you'll be enjoying good income resources professional rising your dignity will be enhanced business will be booming you're achieving gain profit comfort luxuries lifestyle everybody will support you if you're leading a professional organization if you're leading a project or program or company whole team will support you thick or thin and make you successful your success can multiply by 11 times with team effort cancer in month of february 2023 prominent dates for any important contract as for if you are signing any important contract organizing any important event or meeting romantic date business contract date test date exam date meeting somebody very special 4th 5th 9th 10th 16th 17th 18th 19th 24th 25th 26th 27th 28th of february prominent dates are these so month of february pick any of these dates can see we show all the very best of luck leo month of february conclusion for the month leo first thing first result of mercury in 5th house 
position of market in fifth house, the result of market in fifth house from the, from the starting of the month of February till sixth of February. First six days of Mercury in fifth house, the house of recognition, appreciation, common sense and wisdom and education. By applying your intelligence, you will earn a lot. Applied wisdom will make you successful. Superior may grant you favors. Family will provide you comforts. You will be comfortable. You will acquire name, fame and fulfilling your desires. In examination, you will meet success. Enjoy hard studies. Generally, you have a lots of comfort. Because Mercury transit in 5th house. Till 6th of February. Not after 6th of February. After 6th of February, from 7th of February till 27th of February, Sun, Mercury, Buddha, Aditya, Yoga will be there. Sun and Mercury together in this phase of time. So result of Sun and Mercury in 6th house, Buddha, Aditya, Yoga in 6th house. Due to this, there will be destruction of enemies. You have a harmony with your friends, the dearest and dearest one. There will be success in your litigation and gain in business. Your maternal uncle will face adversely. Adversity this phase of time. There may be some kind of a issue with your health regarding eyesight issue. And family can be sometimes not very well health wise. You'll have an affection with favorable people around you. Sometimes less happiness from, uh, you have a lot more favors from friends. But less happiness from relationship. Sometimes you find friends will be all thick and thin, support you all the time, but relatives won't support you. Life remains usual. This particular phase of time indicates success, stability, progression in your personal life. Your plan, project will be successfully accomplished. You will also gain from the same. You will also like to do better in work front. You may expect a progression in all your undertaking. Saturn and Venus together in 7th house. From Venus will leave 6th house and going to the 7th house. But Venus is already with Saturn in 7th house. May I say from 22nd of January till 15th of February. Saturn and Venus together till 15th of February in 7th house. The house of marriage, the house of joint ventures. There will be change of residence. Foreign journey will be or suffering from traveling will be there. Money can be lost in risk taking tendencies. And enemies will cause you fear. There may be false allegation will be imposed upon you. You may be tempted to associate with a lot of companions. Abdominal pain may be a source of suffering. You may marry. You may find a lot of opportunity to enjoy overindulging in players. Business will be profitable. You succeed in your undertaking. But you acquire a lot of comforts. Travel may net you earning. Stay away from any litigation involving companions. Try to maintain a good rapport with your own partner. Moreover, this phase also indicates ill health. And may I say that um, if you are a married person, your wife will can face a lot of issues. For us, it's not very good period. It would be, would be better to stay away from any dealing with dodgy people, dodgy companion. You may also realize that some wicked companion would try to harm you. Try to expose you. Be careful. Sun and Saturn together in 7th house. 13th of February till 15th of March. Sun and Saturn together in 7th house. The house of marriage. Both are sworn enemies. You need to be extra careful not to challenge your seniors or superior at workplace. They are likely to oppose you. Resulting in enmity and humiliation. Even the relationship with your partner or neighbor may be a bit strained at this time. Your level of enthusiasm may be all time low, resulting in inability to overcome a lot of obstacles that come in your way of achieving your dream objective or goals during this phase of time. Result of Jupiter and Venus in 8th house and starting from 15th of February till 12th of March 2023. Jupiter and Venus in 8th house. Your spouse enjoying financial gain due to this union. Due to this phase of time and may I say that this phase of time when the Jupiter and Venus in 8th house this signifies uh, a good time in some sense. Due to this phase of time you may expect comfort overcoming all your previous miseries. You may consider acquiring a land or property 
o car if you are eligible bachelor or companion you may expecting a very good match who will also bring in good fortune for you you may also expecting a companionship of pleasant people beautiful companion that could happen stand by result of mars in 10th house the starting from the 1st of february till the end of the month the mars transiting in your, in your house of profession wealth will be gained you face a lot of pro- promotion you have a lot of promotion like a, have a promotion in your profession rising in your profession benefit from decision maker benefit benefit from high authorities but you will be able to dominate any of your opponents having a success in your undertaking your health will be strong and improved you may becoming a center of lot of controversy which you something which you have committed in the past due to that you become controversial be careful your professional status will be rising there will be domestic harmony you dominating lot of your opponents and enemies be careful prominent dates for you for signing any important contract event meeting romantic date business contract date business dealing date ar first second Third, seventh, eighth, twelfth, thirteenth, eighteenth, nineteenth, twentieth, twenty-first, twenty-sixth, twenty-seventh, twenty-eighth of February. Pick any of these dates and achieve success. But these are the best date for you. But we wish you all the very best of luck. Virgo monthly monthly conclusion month of February two thousand twenty-three for all of you. first thing first result of mercury transiting in your fourth house your lord planet mercury transiting your own chart monthly chart in fourth house is starting from the 1st of february till 6th of february mercury position trans- transiting in your fourth house due to this virgo there will be harmony with your nearest nearest one you have a domestic harmony superior may grant you favors you may acquiring some sort of a property or land your mother will be supportive toward you relationship will be harmonious family wise you'll have a peace of mind and happiness no doubt about it now sun and mercury in the 5th house mercury will leave the 4th house on 7th of february join the sun in 5th house there is a buddh aditya yog in 5th house starting from 7th of february till 27th of february next 20 days buddh aditya yog sun and mercury together in 5th house is a raj yog there is a positive effect of raj yog but due to this factor sun number in 5th house be aware of any arguments and conflict with your nearest to this one your expenditure can be excessive and there are a lot of benefit from the government or from the authority higher authority will appreciate you recognize you and give you some kind of a promotion or status or backing but due to this phase of time you must try to avoid getting involved in any kind of argument with your family members and this time period try to take a review of your attitude your behavior this is not a right time to be headstrong or highly opinionated when you dealing with your friends and family be careful be extra careful while you handling with your loved one health could be a matter of concern at this particular phase of time be careful but try not to overreact in any situation but higher authorities will appreciate you recognize you give you status prestige and honor result of saturn and venus in 6th house is starting already from 2nd 22nd of january 2023 will carry on till saturn and venus together in 6th house till 15th of february you have a lot of secret worries and stable temper your enemies will create a fear and you have a lot of conflicting situations If you have any enemies, you'll be able to annihilate all of them. You'll meet success in litigation. Desire would be fulfilled. Wealth can be gained. Rise in profession, rise in status, prestige, and honor. This particular month brings some trying time for you. This particular period sees you going through a lot of troubles in in your undertaking. There, there is a chance that your enemies will be rising. You may even getting involved in fights with your partner. you may have to compromise with your enemies against your will avoid any arguments with your family members be be aware of that be careful but certain position may i say that in this house have to certain venus in sixth house not positive you need to do a uh, go for the premium horoscope and apply the hard task which you need to do please 
Sun and Saturn, and we see that in sixth house. Sun and Saturn in sixth house. We see that um, this phase, Sun and Saturn, sixth house phase. This period bring success in every aspect of your life. And may I say that Sun and Saturn together in uh, sixth house, this phase of time, uh, may I say that this period brings success in every aspect of your life. You'll find yourself overcoming obstacles easily. It's a great time for successful problem solving. If anyone get in your way, you will be able to deal with minimum efforts, minimum aggravation. It is a good time. May I say, Saturn and Sun together in sixth house. Uh, may I say that this phase also is a good time to complete any unfinished project and you like you to succeed in whatever you put efforts in. May I say that this particular phase of time you'll be quite successful whatever the effort you put in. Financially, you may also do well. You find it easy to gain in general. Your mental and physical health will be good. And this phase, may I say that you'll be extremely unique and good. This phase, our particular phase of time. Jupiter and Venus in 7th house. And starting from 15th of February to 12th of March, Jupiter and Venus in 7th house. Happiness will come to you suddenly. When the Jupiter Venus in 7th house, this union is very prominent. Wealth, name, fame, professional rising will be gained. You'll be developing a lot of fruitful association. Journeys will be proved to be comfortable to you. Comfort will come from partner. Chances that you may even create a lot of new companionship. This period will see a lot of you more enjoying companionship, friendship. Professionally, this period could be regarded as conducive for joint ventures. Your colleagues will help you in progression. You're likely to get honor from higher authorities in your field of work. Things will be achievable. If you are starting a new project, new venture is a good timing. And you will come across lots of opportunities. If you're a single, you'll be there's a ready to mingle. You'll find a very fine companionship. No doubt about it. From 15th of February till 12th of March, you'll definitely find somebody very special. Stand by. Position of Mars. Result of Mars position in ninth house. Travel opportunity will come to you. And you, you, if you're going abroad, you're achieving something dignified. You receive a lot of favor from your superiors. Your professional life will be having a rising. You'll dominate over your opponents. Good health, domestic harmony will prevail. Your desire will be fulfilled. You have a success. A lot of accomplishment will be there. Success will be there. A lot of comfort and luxuries and lifestyle will be there. Support will be gained. No doubt about it. Prominent date for month of February for Virgo. For signing any important contract. Organizing any important meeting, event. Romantic date, business contract date. Business dealings are 1st, 2nd, 3rd, 4th, 5th, 9th, 10th. 14th, 15th, 18th, 19th, 20th, 21st, 22nd, 23rd of February are the prominent date for signing any important contract, to starting anything new, organizing any important meeting, romantic date, test, exam, presentation. You'll be achieving success. Wish you all the very best of luck. Libra monthly conclusion month of February 2023. For all of you, Libra. This particular month, may I say first thing first, result of Mercury in third house till 6th of February. Starting of the month, till from the 1st of February till 6th of February, Mercury transit in third house, Libra. But uh, position of Mercury in third house is not very good. Not at all. Frequently, you will travel quite a lot. But through personal courage, you will be able to dominate a lot of your opponents. But you have to Communicate with the world around you quite a lot. Quite a lot. More you communicate with the world, more you have an opportunity. If the communication becomes zilch or coming to the standstill, the achievements will disappear automatically. But you come across lots of technical obstacles, technical issues. But this particular phase of time, the Mercury transit in third house till 6th of February, 
comfort will be there business activities more you become active creative dynamic more you will achieving income resources less you active less your income will be so communication peak activity peak opportunity will be peak and more you creating a communication with world around you more you liberating the opportunity more you'll have a gain in wealth and name and fame and establishment result of sun and mercury in fourth house mercury joining the sun in fourth house and starting from 7th of february till 27th of february buddh aditya yoga in fourth house this is a raj yoga libra you may develop few disputes with people around you personally or professionally government employee will have a dispute with the higher authorities with the officials libra they may be change of place you might find an opportunity to go abroad and there will be progression in some aspect of your life on personal front if you would like to do this phase of time making you content and you'll achieve success in all your undertakings authority will appreciate you recognize you offer you something most dignified rise in status prestige and honor your status in society will be heightened you would be honored you'll be acquiring a wealth property wealth property and authority that is a buddha aditya yog in fourth house now i'm talking about result of saturn and venus in fifth house starting from 22nd of january till 15th of february saturn and venus in fifth house hard work will pay you back in the form of wealth more you putting an effort in your routine more you liberating money and wealth your family life will be very comfortable if you have any enemies you'll be able to dominate over them they will be rising in name fame fulfilling your desire more you become active creative determined driven more you'll be rising travel is likely to happen this particular phase signifies this particular time mostly spent on being entertainment creativity passion love affection care lot of attention this period also do it good timing financially you will be able to raise your funds if you are taking any kind of test exam any departmental exam you are achieving success through this phase of time if you are taking any examination any any professional exam you will be achieving success you are most likely to be successful if you are employed you like to get a promoted during this phase of time sun and saturn fifth house sun and saturn are fifth house sun is joining saturn in fifth house starting from 13th of february till 15th of march sun and saturn together in fifth house this particular time mostly may i say sun and saturn union i i don't admire the union sun and saturn union no most of the time sun and saturn together and venus suffer due to this union this combination sun and saturn saturn is fireball is is going in the fifth house fifth house belong to sun saturn is there <laughs> like it like a lease holder sun is the lord and sun and saturn in fifth house the the venus automatically uh, lost is the glory the venus automatically will be defected this particular time mostly when the sun and saturn together when i say from 13th of february till 15th of march you have to take extra care not to get involved in bad books of seniors Avoid any kind of arguments with your employer, with your senior, anybody, personally or professionally. You may have to deal with some kind of obstacles, which could be related to competitors, authorities, people you have unfriendly relationship with. If you express your mental anxiety, you like you to lose goodwill among us, your friends and family. Health will require attention. You may be sick, mental anguish, fear. restlessness may cast a spell on you make you more prone to be offended by others sun and saturn combination is not very unique combination so if i was you take a premium horoscope root out saturn position to fifth house completely and result of jupiter and venus in sixth house venus and jupiter together venus venus joined the jupiter in, in sixth house 
सिक्स हाउस वीनस एंड जुपिटर बहुत आर नॉट मेड फॉर सिक्स हाउस पोजिशन ऑफ वीनस इन सिक्स हाउस नॉट कंपेटेबल पोजिशन ऑफ जुपिटर इन सिक्स हाउस नॉट कंपेटेबल कॉम्बिनेशन ऑफ जुपिटर वीनस इज वेरी प्राइम कॉम्बिनेशन वेरी हाई क्लास कॉम्बिनेशन सिक्स हाउस इज नॉट दैट हाई क्लास सॉरी एंड स्टार्टिंग दिस कॉम्बिनेशन इन फैक्ट विल बी फ्रॉम फिफ्टीन फेबर टिल ट्वेल्थ ऑफ मार्च your enemies will be rising so you will make a lot of frequent arguments and quarrels with people around you personally and professionally you may also suffer from a lot of anguish disease abdominal discomfort especially if you're a lady there may be some sort of a um, some sort of trying time for you this period you're going through a lot of trouble in your profession your career even in your personal relationship there's a chance that your enemies will be rising and you may even get involved in more arguments or fight with your own partner You may have to compromise with your enemies against your will. Result of Mars in eighth house is not for the not very good position of Mars. Eighth house is not good at all. May I request you properly and if you can take a premium horoscope, monthly horoscope, as a definitely there is a task given to you for rooting out the Mars position from eighth house. Do those ta hard tasks, please, please, please. Mars position in eighth house is not good. It's not good for the health and well-being. You must suffer a lot of health issues. Be aware of an accident. Any health issue linked with the digestive system, anything to do with blood or loss of blood. Be careful. Be aware of an accident. There may be injury from some kind of a sharp object or due to accident. Be aware of that. Be careful of that. You may even undergo some kind of a surgery due to position of Mars in eighth house. Wealth can be lost. You may suffer a lot of domestic strife, domestic argument, living conflict in your personal life. You will have a lot of secret worries or tension. There will be loss of earnings, loss of money. You may incline to do a lot of unscrupulous deeds, and which you don't want to mention or anything. There may be sort of come some kind of some kind of illness or suffering. Be aware of that. Your opponent will dominate you. If you're living a conflict, if you're living in a conflict, the opponent will take you over. You may pass through a lot of mental anguish during this phase of time. Abdominal pain, eye disease, cough, cold may affect you. Prominent dates for important signing a contract. Prominent date for you know, organizing any important event or meeting. Romantic date and uh, signing any uh, opening like a starting in a romantic romance. A prominent dates for signing a business contract or dealings are fourth, fifth, sixth, seventh, eighth, twelfth, thirteenth, sixteenth, seventeenth, twenty second, twenty third, twenty fourth, twenty fifth of February are the prominent dates, which will be great dates for you to accomplish something dignified, most dignified. Pick any of these days, achieve the best. Scorpio, month of February, the conclusion for you. the for month of february for scorpio first thing first result of mercury transiting second house so scorpio is starting from the start of the month till 6th of february scorpio if you have any opponents you dominate over them you enjoy domestic harmony there will be rising in income resources and wealth gain to your name and fame are possible result of sun and mercury in third house complete result of sun and mercury in third house scorpio is may I say starting from 7th of february till 27th of february from mercury will move from second house to third house there will be rise in income resources rise in big in vitality sun and mercury in third house buddh ajitya yoga in third house more you communicate with world around you more you achieving wealth fame honor name and fame and establishment opportunities Sun and Mercury together in third house. The Buddha did the yoga in third house. You'll gain name and fame and dominance, and over your opponents, there will be favor from higher authorities. Health will be good. There may be a lot of problem to your brother or colleagues. You'll put a lot of effort in your activities. Improve your communication with people around you, personally or professionally. Achievements will be there. There will be acquisition of money, of food, acquisition of lifestyle, success in government job. definitely more you communicate more you achieve success especially in your job profession career more you communicate with world around you more you will be able to liberate opportunities for yourself and for the other people you have to be extra careful when you dealing with superiors and employers avoid any kind of arguments that may lead to difference opinion and clashes be clear be careful of that result of saturn and venus in fourth house 
Saturn Venus in fourth house, Saturn twenty second January till fifteenth uh, of February. Saturn Venus together in the fourth house. In starting from twenty second January till fifteenth of February two thousand twenty three, wealth vehicle will be acquired. You gain from land and business. You have a material comfort. Your family will enjoy comfort. The government or those people who have higher position will favor you. There is some chance of wasteful expenditure, dissociation of dearest to dearest one, instability of temper, and the social aspect of your life will be full of happy and happening. Your popularity would be rising. You are most likely to acquire a lot of new friends. The company of old and new friends would give you much more harmony, happiness. You may consider buying a property and staying away from. Sometimes it's like a, this phase of time, may as a Saturn position and Venus position in fourth house. You make sure that there should not be any living conflict in the family. You might buy a property or buy a new car. Uh, this phase of time, you might invest in a property. Be careful. But may I say that uh, this phase of time, you got to be extra careful. Result of Jupiter and Venus in the fifth house. So Venus left the fourth house and joined the Jupiter in fifth house, it's starting from fifteenth of February till twelfth of March, two thousand twenty-three. Venus and Jupiter in fifth house. A new project will be there for you, waiting for you, or if you're a family man, a new child may be born to you, because this is a beautiful union. Venus and Jupiter in fifth house is starting from fifteenth of February till twelfth of March. Either you'll be loaded with a new project, new venture, new idea, or you'll have a beautiful child, or something to celebrate regarding your success and prosperity. Wealth can be gained during this phase of time. You'll enjoy a rise in name and fame. You'll be thoroughly recognized and appreciated by professional people, by powerful people. People will appreciate you, recognize your knowledgeability and skill set. You'll be able to accomplish what you've been waiting for for a long, long time. Jupiter and Venus together in fifth house. If you have any opponents, you'll dominate over them. You'll be acquiring knowledge, ability, and skill set. Your health will be good. This period donate good timing financially. You would be able to raise your funds if you're taking any examination, departmental exam, professional educational exam, any test, any kind of test. Under any government exam, university exam, college exam, school exam, any sort entrance test, any entrance test, any government department exam, due to this phase of time, you're most likely to be successful, most likely to pass that exam. If employed, you're likely to get promoted due to this phase of time. If you're going for an interview or presentation, highly successful in your efforts. Moreover, you may also expecting a rise in position in society. Your friends. Teachers are expected to be good to you during this phase of time. Relationship expected to be go smoothly. You may expect intense, sensuous time with your beloved. You'll enjoy it thoroughly. Most efforts, most creative efforts, will be handsomely rewarded. No doubt about it. Result of Mars in seventh house. This whole month, from the first of February till the twenty-eighth of February, Mars transit in seventh house. You have to look after your word of speech. You have to look after your behavior. You got to think before you speak to anybody, personally or professionally. And if you're going through any health problem, be aware of that. And be aware of any kind of a living conflict. Do not start or invite any living conflict in your personal life or professional life. Uh, look after any health regarding tummy, lower abdomen. But at the same time, Mars position seventh house. Uh, you're going through a lot of anguish, mental anguish, and refrain from any unscrupulous activities. If you're traveling, you'll experience a lot of suffering. But Mars position in seventh house, no good. You have to neutralize this position. And but in this Saturn and Venus together in fourth house, part of it is good. And but may I say, Sun and Mercury, third house. I, you need to do quite a lot to make the Mercury very good in third house. Mercury can stumble Sun so if you want, if you Mercury want to. So we have to keep a close eye on the Mercury, but we want to make this flawless of Buddha Ditte Yoga. Communication becomes sky high, opportunity achievement sky high, and 
accomplishment will be mag magnified, no doubt about it. Mercury position in second house is prominent. So these are the, but seventh house position of Mars is no good. So that's, that's my, but prominent date for any important signing contract, organizing any important meeting, event, romantic date, business contract dealings are 7th, 8th, 9th, 10th, 14th, 15th, 18th, 19th, 24th, 25th, 26th, 27th, 28th of February are the prominent dates. Are These are the prominent date for the month uh, of February. Pick any of these dates. Wish you all the very best of luck. Sagittarius. Month of February 2023. The conclusion of the month for Sagittarius. And... In this particular month, Sagittarius is the month of February, starting with Mercury's uh, uh, transiting in Lagna. Starting from the 1st of February till 6th of February, Mercury transit in Lagna for Sagittarius. If there are any enemies present to you, you will dominate over them. A new business interest may uh, come your way. Mentally, you will be okay. Your spouse, family, life, especially if you're married, you'll be fine. Through your intelligence and common sense, you'll enjoy good earnings. Your health will be good. There will be some sort of enhancement to your status, prestige and honor. If you are an IT man, if you are an IT consultant, if you are an IT woman, IT consultant, if you are banking sector, this, this will be your time for rising, accomplishing something dignified. Result of Sun and Mercury in second house. The Buddha Aditya Yoga in second house, starting from 7th of February till 27th of February 2023. This phase, this particular time period, when the Sun and Mercury join together in second house, this signifies financial gain, promotion, income resources, acquiring wealth, property, assets, authority. Yes, you'll be thoroughly recognized for your knowledgeability and skill set, and you'll be rewarded handsomely. If you're in banking sector, if you're self-employed, if you're a manufacturer, if you're into, if you're working in the financial sector, anything to do with finance, anything to do with stock and share market, anything to do with buy and sell and commission agency, yes, your most efforts will be rewarded. If you're a precious stone dealer, if you're any kind of dealer, most of your efforts will be rewarded. This period I to bring harmony, happiness to you in the form of success, in the form of learning, in the form of knowledge, ability, skill set. You'll be upgrading yourself. Result of Saturn and Venus in third house is starting from 22nd of January last month till 15th of February. 22nd of January till 15th of February 2023. Saturn Venus transit in third house. So association with your friends. Association with the world, communication with your friends, world will be profitable to you. You'll be coming across lots of opportunities. You'll be coming across lots of companions as well. Your undertaking will meet success with money will be gained. You'll be inclined to take a lot of journeys. In your domestic life, there will be harmony. Your health will be good. You'll be dominating over your opponents. You'll have excessive enthusiasm. Your undertaking will meet success. You'll gain wealth. Benefit from the favor of higher authorities or those people who have power, position. They can offer you something dignified. Result of Sun and Saturn in third house. Sun and Saturn in third house result is starting from 13th of February till 15th of March. Sun and Saturn together in third house. And this position of Sun and Saturn in third house this bringing some sort of a positive timing in your professional life, in your personal life. This boosting you, you this, this progression in your career, rising your recognition from the employer point of view, from the authorities will be given to you. There's a rise in chance of promotion or better employment. You feel more energetic, more enthusiastic. You experience heightened ability to overcome all your obstacles. No doubt about it. Resolving a lot of your problems. Lot of your obstructions. Accomplishing something dignified. Accomplishing something dignified and unique. No doubt about it. And achievement. Sun and Saturn together in third house. 
it accomplishment will be there achievements will be there you'll be uh, communicating with the whole world and you want like to ac- accomplish something dignified and achievements will be there at that time you would like to make something dignified and unique result of jupiter and venus in fourth house starting from 15th of february till 12th of march jupiter venus in fourth house this union in fourth house is the most magnified union land property business will provide financial gain there is a harmony happiness achievements reward name fame establishment you have access to comfort lifestyle luxuries your family will do well you may benefit from higher favors from authorities from professional people you will benefit from a lot of professional people even government will favor you your enemies will favor you you will enjoy good income resources good financial backing this union donates financial growth for you jupiter venus in fourth house you will have a luxuries and lifestyle you could also expecting a rise in prosperity name fame establishment if you are a manufacturer if you are self employed you could prove to be good timing to bringing profit in your business venture at home you like you to spend quality time with your family member discussing a matter of importance result of mars in 6th house you will be able to annihilate your opponents have a success in your matter of litigation your status will be elevated you'll enjoy a favor from those people who have power position higher authorities you'll be acquiring comfort lifestyle benefit will come to you due to favor from those people who have wealth and power in general you'll have a lot of comforts may i say that this phase of time when the mars position 6 house will root out your enemies it will root out your problems in this particular mars position 6th house can root out your all the hassles and status will be rising you'll be enjoying favor from everybody you'll be acquiring comfort luxuries benefit prominent dates for any signing any important contract organizing any important meeting event business contract dealings are first second third ninth 10th 11th 12th 13th 16th 17th 20th 21st 26th 27th 28th of february we show all the very best of luck pick any of these days achievement will be dignified and success will be there capricorn monthly conclusion month of february 2023 the conclusion of the month for capricorn in this coming month first thing first result of mercury in 12th house this will start from the start of the month 1st of february till 6th of february mercury transit in 12th house opponent will be rising you may have a lot of trouble with government you will have expenditure will be excessive physically you may feel some time as well as having some sort of a anguish sometime achievements expectation reality won't match you eyes will create a trouble for you result of mercury in seventh in in lagna result of sun and result of i'll do this again result of sun and mercury in lagna in uh, and do does this again result of sun and mercury in your lagna starting from 7th of february till 27th of february for 20 days both aditya yog in your lagna capricorn capricorn you will be very active you'll be very creative you'll be very dynamic you'll be able to lead a project lead a venture lead a organization your knowledge ability skill set will be recognized and appreciated you'll be quite tactful in your approach you'll be able to handle all kind of challenges all kind of complications you have to take care to avoid facing a hole over the coals and lashes of unsympathetic words from other people keeping a low profile doing your task best should be the focus during this phase of time you can accomplishments can be unique most dignified knowledge ability skill set will be recognized by professional people there will be rise in status prestige and honor you will be able to lead an organization 
this particular phase of time when buddha jit yog happening in your lagna you definitely achieving money and status together capricorn saturn venus in second house starting from start of start of the month till 15th of february maybe i say start since 22nd of january till 15th of february saturn venus together in second house friends will provide you benefits and you associate with a lot of companions you will be able to fulfill your desire and have a success in your venture there will be excessive wealth acquisition of money this period also see you having a great timing with your partner and other family members financially you would be comfortable prosperity of your family in general is expected to be a forward move achievements will be there rewards will be there accomplishment will be there you'll be able to make a lot of name and fame and establishment for yourself result of sun and saturn in second house sun and saturn second house result is starting from 13th of february till 15th of march sun and saturn together in second house and may i say that sun and saturn both are not friends with each other both are sworn enemies um the combination of their father and son with animosity is there is starting um, may i say from 13th of february till 15th of march due to this union you could prove to have a coming across lot of financial challenges this period um sometime you got to watch your word of speech watch your aggression watch your temper watch whatever you have to say sometime due to your attitude due to your actions due to your dealing due to your manner due to your communication with people around you sometime this absence of expected result absence of expected profit in trade if you are self employed if you are dealing in trading or, agri- or agriculture or manufacturing this period will bring some sort of some kind of setbacks this is a time period you must most you will be more susceptible to a lot of fears than usual result of jupiter and venus in third house 15th of february till 12th of march jupiter venus in third house and the venus and jupiter third house and this phase of time association with your friends and relatives is harmonious association with your siblings will be okay jupiter venus in third house communication will be sky high and you have a lot of contact with people around you friends family they will provide you some kind of a opportunities there may be some some kind of a sudden loss of money but due to you error of judgment but business will provide you gain be aware of error of judgment but business will provide you gain you'll have an inclination toward virtuous deeds this to create harmony happiness contentment for you you may expect an upward move in your financial condition giving you financial security this could also be professionally good period for you you may also expecting a rise in position you may also expecting a gain in authority your ventures are likely to earn profit as well result of mars in fifth house position of mars in fifth house your family may suffer abdominal just disease may be source of your trouble you will suffer for a lot of disappointments loss of status little um, some kind of a some to peace of mind will not be there you may suffer a lot of injury and sometime you have a lot of issues even uh, look after your temper look after your behavior look after your relationship with people around you mars position fifth house watch your temper watch your aggression don't do anything which you can't justify please prominent dates for any important signing any important contract prominent date for organizing any important event to meeting or business contract dealings are prominent date if you are going for exam test when the romantic dates are 1st 2nd 3rd 4th 5th 12th 13th 14th 15th 18th 19th 22nd 23rd of february are the prominent dates for you to appearing any of these pick for signing important contract or romantic date organizing any important event or dealings or business contract dealing achievements will be there aquarius month of february conclusion month of february for the whole month aquarius first thing first result of saturn and venus in lagna 
in your first house. Saturn Venus together in your Lagna Aquarius. Starting since 22nd of January till 15th of February 2023. Saturn Venus together in your Lagna. Aquarius you will be very active. Very creative. May I say very dynamic. You will be fulfilling your desires. Indulging in luxuries. Lifestyle. Enjoying harmony. Professionally there is a rise in status. Rise in status, prestige and honor. There will be a promotion. There's a rise in income resources. You'll be associating with many, many companions. Achievements will be there. Dignified achievements will be there. This phase of time, you'll accomplish something most dignified, what you've been waiting for. Result of Jupiter and Venus in second house is starting from 15th of February till 12th of March. This is a union made in heaven. <laughs> Jupiter Venus together in Pisces is starting from 15th of February till 12th of March. Business, travel will provide you earnings. You have some sort of a rise in status, benefit from government favors, income will be good, income will be rising, opportunity to go on religious journeys. You may acquiring a comfort, luxuries, lifestyle. This mostly donate financial gain for you. This period sees you having a great time with your partner and family members. You'll enjoy it thoroughly. If applicable, you can also expect a new member in the family. Financially, you'll be quite comfortable. Prosperity will be there. And they will be rising. And expectation and achievements are matching together. What you've been expecting from this time, achievements will be there. No doubt about it. Result of Mars in 4th house. This phase, beware of any big row, living conflict personally or professionally. You may be separated from your friends or relatives. Some sort of a living conflict will happen. And look after your peace of mind and happiness and even family members' health. You may have an injury caused by accident. Beware of that. And there might be loss of property or loss of money if you're not careful watch your temper watch your aggression watch your action or reaction you may have losses in regarding wealth regarding money regarding property you may have if be careful you have some kind of a no peace of mind when the mass transit in fourth house peace of mind disturbed journey may be source of trouble be careful Beware of any living argument and conflict. Mercury transiting in 11th house till 6th of February. Starting from the 1st of February till 6th of February. Mercury transit in 11th house. You'll have a gain in health and vigor and vitality. Travel will provide you gain and grant you some kind of a money. Your dignity, your status will be enhanced. You will be able to fulfill your desire, achieving your name, gain, name and fame and accomplishments will be there. Acquiring some kind of wealth, some kind of a deal working for you, achieving you money. Some sort of business deal will be there for you to support financially. You'll be inclined towards a lot of learning, upgrading your knowledge, ability and skill set. During this phase of time, your thinking power will be rising. Your common sense is working for you and bringing you solution to your problem. Sun and Mercury are transiting in 12th house, starting from 7th of February till 27th of February. Sun, Mercury transit in 12th house. And during this phase of time, uh, when Sun and Mercury transit 12th house, Buddha Aditya Yoga in 12th house, and this donate expenses. You may have to spend more than expected in order to live a comfortable life. Debts will be rising. Stay away from any litigation, and that will cause you loss of money. Between 7th of February till 27th of February, stay away from any litigation, please. That will cost you loss of money. You will have to work extra hard in order to accomplish any task undertaken by you. There may be eye disease, headaches, abdominal problem during this phase of time. You'll be excited extremely high. There will be bitterness in your temperament. Loss of funding will be there. Disappointment may be faced by you. Sometime achievement, accomplishment won't match. There may be issues regarding health issues. The expenditure on treatment of illness would be excessive. 
You must suffer a lot of false allegation. People will blaming you for a lot of things. The spending on a lot of things will be there for you. Sun and Saturn transit in first house, 13th of February till 15th of March. Sun and, uh, Sun and Saturn transit in first house. And the Sun and Saturn transit in first house. This phase, there's a noticeable influence on your workplace, in your personal life. There could be permanent or temporary change of place, difficulty at workplace, ruffle time with your seniors at home, superior at workplace or your employer. Please do look after your health. Do look after your well-being. Whatever you do, please do look after your health and well-being. Do watch your decisions and choices. Prominent date for important contract or signing any important event or meeting. Business meeting, contract dealings are 4th, 5th, 6th, 7th, 8th, 12th, 14th, 15th, 16th, 17th, 20th, 21st, 24th of February, 25th of February. These are the prominent dates are for signing important contract, important event or meeting or business contract dealings are. So pick any of these days, achieve your success and prosperity and name and fame and establishment. Pisces month of February. The conclusion of the month is this. Conclusion for Pisces. Result of Jupiter and Venus in first house. Jupiter and Venus in first house is uh, starting from 15th of February. Jupiter and Venus are together from 15th of February till 12th of March 2023. Jupiter and Venus are together in first house. Um, your family will be favorable for you. Business will be very productive and association with friends will be most profitable. Vehicles, wealth will be favorable. You'll be able to fulfill your desires, achievements will be there. You have some sort of rise in status, prestige and honor. There will be a promotion. Name and fame will be there. Jupiter Venus is a, is a dream union. Name and fame and accomplishment will be there. This mostly signifies success, comfort, luxuries. You may be expecting a lot of happy happiness a lot of happening as well on the personal front if you eligible bachelor you find a very fine match during this phase of time some of you are also expecting the arrival of the new member of the family show sure, sure, this is a good period to meet a lot of new people enjoying com companionship result of mars in third house your status will be rising there will be a rise in status prestige and honor social sure, sure, circle will be enhanced You'll be acquiring a land property. You'll be dominating your lot of your opponents. There may be favor from higher authorities. Your family may be suffering somehow due to aggression, due to conflict, due to lack or lack of communication. Due to that family can suffer. Your desire will be fulfilled due to this phase of time. There will be success through personal effort. If under any litigation you succeed, Result of Mercury in 10th house is happening till 6th of February. Mercury transit in 10th house from the 1st of February till 6th of February. You would be very happy, very successful in all your undertaking. Professionally, a very good period could be expected as well. You would be able to finish off the work given to you successfully on time. You could also expect to meet someone very interesting during this phase of time. Some of you were also expecting to spend some passionate time with someone new companion possibility of gain from this person is also indicated during this phase of time financially this could be a good time for you result of sun and mercury in 11th house starting from 7th of february till 27th february sun and mercury in 11th house the buddha aditya yoga there in the 11th house is raj yoga you will gain wealth you will gain comforts rising uh, professional rising will come in your profession You'll be enjoying enhancement, status, prestige, honor. You'll be inclined to perform a lot of good deeds. If you're married, you will have a lot of comfort from your partner. Your friends, relatives would be helpful. They would be gaining your professional status. If you're leading a project or a company, your team effort will bring most dignified rewards for you. Achievements will be there. You may also looking for new residents. There may be abdominal pain during this phase of time. There will be income from business and other undertaking. Your status will be rising. Inflow of wealth 
would be more. You'll have a harmony with your friends and nearest to dearest one. You may acquiring a vehicle and you'll have an inclination to do a lot of virtuous deeds. Health of family may be area of concern, but be careful. Don't do anything which you can't justify. But sun and Mercury position in 11th house. Buddha Aditya Yogi in 11th house. Achievements will be there. Status will be there. Wealth will be there. Money will be made. Status will be rising. Accomplishment will be there. Success will be there. And if you are a project manager, if you are a program manager, if you are leading a company, your achievements will be most dignified. Result of Saturn and Venus in 12th house. Starting from, um, is already started since 22nd of January till 15th of February. Saturn, Venus together in um, 12th house. The expenditure can be paramount. You may be, have a lot of fear from um, your own people. Some sort of a mental anguish, disfavor from those people who have authority and power. Travel may be forced upon you. You will be suffering from a lot of eye infection, full feet issue chest issue. Those in authority will be source of your fear. Domestic life will be full of strife and you got to sort out your domestic life. Watch your decisions and choices. Watch your finances. Do not overspend. Don't build up your debts. Don't do anything which you can't justify, please. Sun will join Saturn in 12th house. Starting from 13th of February. Now carry on till um, 15th of March. This union you can't ignore. When Sun and Saturn together in 12th house, this union you can't ignore. This union means financial challenges. You have to take extra care regarding your spending, regarding your expenditure, regarding your finances. If you are self-employed, you will find a bit, bit of a hard time with, your, with this particular phase of time. If you are working in a service sector, again you find very hard time working with your employer. Your employer will not appreciate your hard work. Either employer will give you less work or no work or no responsibility or sometimes no money or let you off. That can happen. So look after your job, profession, career between 13th of February till 15th of March, please. And whatever you're making any decision or choices, you got to sort it out. May I say that this part, in this phase of time, Sun and Saturn should not be joined together in 12th house in Premium monthly horoscope, there are tasks you must do that to sort out Sun and Saturn in 12th house. You can do that. But Saturn Venus in 12th house is very fine union till 15th of February. Again, the most prominent union, Sun and Mercury together in 11th house. Again, very prominent till the Sun and Mercury together in 11th house till 15th of February. But Mercury will be again transiting in 11th house till 27th of February. So stand by. Mercury position in first six days uh, in 10th house, may I say from 1st February till 6th February, again very prominent. Mars position in third house is extremely unique, most dignified. Jupiter Venus in first house till 12th of March is outstandingly unique, very unique, fantastic. And <laughs> that's a dream come true. But Sun and Saturn in 12th house is not very productive union. Sun and Saturn, Saturn on its own is okay. But Sun position 12th house have to be Sort it with the help of hard task. Please do. Prominent date for any important contract. If you're signing any important contract, any event or meeting, uh, business meeting, contract dealing, romantic date, test exam, uh, departmental exam, interview, job presentation. Please pick up any of these dates. Uh, 7th, 8th, 9th, 10th, 16th, 17th. 18th, 19th, 22nd, 23rd, 26th, 27th of February, 28th of February. Pick any of these days. Wish you all the very best of luck and prosperity. I'm sure you have liked this conclusion. And so please press the bell for like and kindly share this conclusion with your friends and family. But become our subscriber if you can. To become a subscriber, you have to visit my website and become our subscriber. And there are benefit to become a subscriber for Android app, if you have an Android phone. And if you have become a subscriber, you can, you can take a 13 weeks trial, like a three monthly, in which 13 weeks trial means you have in that 13 
week timing you have a 13 weekly horoscope full premium horoscopes and three monthly horoscope full premium horoscope that's a, that's a benefit you can have if you have android app if you download of android app you can have that benefit but if you visit my website become our diamond subscriber then we can share a lot with you like a complete horoscope report for 52 weeks complete horoscope full premium horoscope report for 12 monthly horoscope report one yearly horoscope report which means a lot if you become a diamond subscriber we can share 65 reports 65 videos 52 weekly report in whole year 12 monthly horoscope report whole monthly each and every month and one yearly horoscope report 65 report with one subscription fee from you monthly subscription you can have a diamond subscription you have a 65 reports 65 videos in over the one year so whole year so choice is yours so that is the very finest deal i can offer you at the same time i would request you request you try to become our youtube subscriber we can share a lot of content with you yearly horoscope general overview saturn transit effect jupiter transit effect rahu ketu transit effect and at the same time i can share with you a very fine link a live show live streaming link participate in live show live streaming link you can take a consultation on live show live show consultation you can raise me the questions give me your name date of birth place of birth time of birth raise the question from through your birth chart i'll give you an answer so we can share the link as well if you become our youtube subscriber and this is the best i can do for you but if you have a if you download the android app and if you go to the website and take our diamond subscription that will give you ultimate benefit and become our youtube subscriber if you can and wish you all the very best of luck